Okay. See, if you don't want to use Jupyter Notebook, instead of uninstalling it, you may create new virtual machine and OS. So deleting a virtual machine and an OS is uh, from step one, find the uh, OS you want to delete. So I will delete Ubuntu Rob to underscore 2023. So just uh, right click, then uh, remove, choose remove, and delete all files. Okay. So it will be deleted in our computer. So to add new OS, so let's go to new. Then let's name the new OS. So let's name it Ubuntu again. Let's name it uh, for, for testing for installations in installations okay. then click next then uh click next again okay so i suggest that our virtual hard disk size to be used in our programming is 50 gig the default is 25 gig okay so I will uh, make this 50. So this is how you will make your oh, your virtual machine. Uh, and use 50 gig of your of your uh, uh, hard disk C. Okay, next, next, click next, then click finish. Then you have now a new OS in your virtual uh, box. Okay. Next, uh, let's set up first our new OS. So let's go to system. So right click, go to settings, or press or click the settings here. Then let's go to system. Okay, let's check the system. Go to processor. I suggest it, uh, you change the processor up to four. But because it's already only a testing, I will just make it one CPU. Next, let's go to storage. I will just make this uh, larger. Let's go to the empty or to this empty disk or this no disk image file selected. Then from here, let's go to this. Okay, this uh, blue disk at the right. Then click, uh, you may click choose a disk file if the, oh, if the downloaded OS is not uh, shown here, but uh, my downloaded OS is already shown here. So we will use the Ubuntu 20.04.5 desktop AMD 64.ISO. But I will show you if you choose the choose a disk file. So click choose a disk file, then find from your uh, download files the Ubuntu OS. So we will use again a 20.04.5. So click open. This is already at the empty disk right here. I'm going to proceed to clicking OK. Now, let's start our OS. Okay, so it will take time. Okay, so this is the Ubuntu OS. Let's go first to view and let's make it scaled mode. Okay, switch it to scaled mode. 
Then Ubuntu will install. The next step is to wait for the initialization initialization power OS. It will ask us to install install Ubuntu. Okay. So let's check if the language is in English. Then if it's it is in English, let's uh, install Ubuntu. Then check if your keyboard layout is in English. Okay, then if it is in English, click continue. Okay, just uh, click continue and wait. Then click install now. Okay, so there is a warning to rewrite a this, but it is fine because this is a new OS from virtual box. So just click continue. Then let's choose our area. Then continue. Then uh, write your name. Let's choose a password. Okay. Let's confirm the password. Then continue installing. Okay, so it will uh, take some time. Okay, so if the installation is complete, let's restart our virtual machine. Let's click this, uh, this restart now. Then press enter. And wait for the initialization of our Ubuntu OS. Okay. So without Anaconda or Jupyter Notebook, uh, it will just be 8 gig in our disk space. So this is uh, now your new OS, okay?